Hey, what's up everyone? Shannon or Vaping Crazy here today with another review. Today we're going to be looking at the ECAB electronical or electronic cigarette from OvalleyUSA.com. OvalleyUSA.com. I think I have autofocus on so that I will autofocus right there on there. Nice and neat. So I look forward to doing this review for you. I've been checking it out for the past three days, vaping it almost exclusively. And I got to say, I'm pretty impressed for what it does. So let's go ahead and jump on in. We'll take a look at what comes in the box when you get it. All right. So when you get the box, this is what it's going to look like right here. Um, very sleek little looking box has, uh, you know, stuff on the bottom. Let's open this bad boy up. So we open it up and first thing you're gonna see is the electronic cigarette itself um, in this cool little case and it looks just like this when you get it. All right, so let's take this top off and see what comes inside of the box. So inside of the box what you're going to get is right here, whoops, we have the battery charger it's a USB battery charger. All right, right next to it is the wall adapter. Let's see if I can get my hands to work. It's the wall adapter, so you can plug it into the wall. You get three caps for your tanks, and you get three tanks. Two of them are come sealed. Two of them come sealed in here, and the third tank is comes packaged on the unit. All right, then you also get two atomizers uh, in there, and I'm using one obviously, um, but these are standard res atomizers, and then this package right here is what the batteries came in, but I've already taken the batteries out because like I said, I have been uh, using it for the past uh, three days so I could you know, form a proper opinion on it. So that is what you get in the box. All right, so now that you've seen what comes in a box, let's talk about the unit a little bit more. Um, <laughs> first things first is my initial impressions on it is it looks sleek. Um, I asked my wife, I'm like, what do you think of this? And just by looks. And she's like, um, it looks like something a rich man would vape on. <laughs> and I'm like, I, I think you're right. It's very classy. Very, very classy looking is my first, my first initial impression of it. Um, now, it's a tank system that works really a lot like the Ego C, except it's a lot smaller. So what I'm going to do right now is pop up a picture of uh, the battery itself compared to an Ego C battery. And as you can see, um, it's a lot slimmer and a lot sleek, a lot more sleek. I don't know what the word is. Sleeker? That's not even a word. <laughs> it looks sleek. You know, it's it's very svelte. <laughs> um skinny in appearance if you will um and light it's very light as well even with the battery in it imagine um a double a battery about what that that um weighs and it for me that's about what this feels like um so it's very light and what i i like most about it is i can put it in my pocket and you know it's a, a good vape to take with you but uh, we'll get into that stuff later. First, let's check out the mechanics of this bad boy. So, like I said, it's a tank system. So, um, this is the actual tank. And right now it has juice in it. Let's see if I can get this to autofocus. So, right now it has some juice in it. And as you can see, with any tank system, you have some condensation um, that builds up in it. However, this is a their own design of the actual tank. It doesn't look like Ego C tanks. It's their own design, and I think they really did a good job in increasing the uh, the flow, the airflow uh, for the draw. Um, to me, uh, an Ego C type tank system is a tighter draw than what this is, so I really enjoyed that. Um, and the tank itself looks like it holds about one mil of juice in there. So, sorry about my alarm going off on, on my phone. So it holds about one mil of juice in there. And uh, to fill it up, it, it's really easy. And I'll actually demonstrate that for you. I'm using a, uh, uh, a custom blend of two different, um, two different juices. That is uh, strawberry and lemonade. So this is like a strawberry lemonade. And it's 80-20, 80% VG, I mean 80% PG, 20% VG. And to uh, fill this bad boy up, all you need to do is pop the tank off. And the tanks 
are are relatively the tops are relatively easy to get off compared to the Ego C. I don't know what they did. Um, however, for me to get one off on an Ego C, I mean, you really got to pry that sucker on off. On this one, I can just take my fingernail, pop it right off, which is a good improvement for me when it comes to filling this bad boy up. So you just fill it up like so. And as you can see, it fills up rather quickly. And you want to leave a little bit of an air pocket um, at the top so that it has good flow, air flow. Then we're going to pop this back on. And then after we pop the top of the tank back on, we're good to go when it comes to the tank. Now, um, this uses an atomizer setup like the Ego C does. So that right there is your atomizer okay and it go and it, and it goes right on top of the battery all right now the best way to get this in so that it sets properly on top of the battery is to take your cone okay and this is this is the top of the cone this is the bottom of the cone so we're going to take the bottom of the cone we're going to pop this in just like this So I just set it in there, set it in there, give it a little tap to let it s s uh, set itself, and then I just screw that bad boy on. Okay, now um, now it's it's ready to put the tank on. So we're gonna put the tank on, and the way you do that is you just slide it in, wait till you hear a pop, give it a couple good twists. Okay. All right. Now, if this is the first time you're using this atomizer, what you want to do is take a dry draw. You do not put, want to push the button. You just and that that's getting some juice down in there uh, for you. Okay. So this right here is a 350 ma battery, and what that means is 350 milliamp hours. All right. It comes with a safety feature. Um, so right now it's on. When you when you press it, it's kind of clicky. You get a ver uh, uh, a uh, you can hear an audible click, okay, and the light lights up to let you know that it's going. All right, now when you want to put this in your pocket or store it, what you want to do is simply give the sucker a click five times, and it flashes. That means it's off. See, as you can see now, the light doesn't come off; it's off. All right, now to turn it back on, we're going to click it five more times. Once we click it five more times, it flashes, and now it's on. Um, so it's 350 mAh battery um, firing at 3.7 uh, volts, um, which is you know a pretty standard, a uh, pretty standard vape. So for what it is, this is this is awesome so far. So let's take a vape and see how it vapes. Not too bad. Okay, so wh who is going to enjoy this? The type of person that's going to enjoy this is the type of person that wants something that's smaller and lighter and things of that nature, like one of these, you know, electronic cigarette lookalikes. You know, is someone that's uh, puffing on a Proveri every day or a multi or a variable voltage device going to fall in love with this? Probably not. If someone is coming from this, they want something that has more battery life and produces more flavor, more, more vapor, more throat hit. They're abs absolutely going to love this. However, they don't want something that's big. Um, and what I'm going to do, I'm going to compare this. I'm going to show you a picture, but I'll, I'll show you right here. The picture you'll be able to see it better but it's only slightly longer than the actual electronic cigarette it's actually um with the tank and everything it's only five a little bit over five inches long and it's like five and one quarter or not even one quarter like um one sixteenth um inches long so it's a very short device a very uh, light device and um people that are looking for you know a better tank type system I think are going to love this. So if you're coming from 
a electronic cigarette look-alike with the smaller batteries and the you know cartridges and things like that and you just weren't happy with it um, upgrading to something like this is really going to um, be good for you you're, you're going to enjoy it and it's um, pretty darn uh, affordable too so I'm going to go to Avali USA right now and I believe I don't want to misquote the price so I'm going to Yes, it's $52 at the time of this recording on their uh, website. So, and yeah. Let's, let's vape it a couple more times. Not too shabby. Um, I vape this um, almost exclusively. I can't say exclusively, but um, almost exclusively for the last two days. Um, the battery life on it is surprisingly long. Um, I was getting about three, uh, three, three and a half um, at the max. I got four hours out of this vaping at a pretty good pace. Um, when I vape, I especially on something like this, I take a longer pull. And, and I work from home, so I vape pretty consistently, and I got a good three and a half hours on average. I would say three hours out of this battery, so that's really darn impress, uh, really darn impressive. Um, and then you just put them on the charger. You uh, have two batteries, so when one comes out, you just slap the other one in, and you're good to go. Um, so you're not uh, losing, you know, vape time waiting on your your um, battery to charge. And so we went over the look and the feel. Feels great. The vape is is a good vape. It's not you know a variable voltage get vape. But obviously, that's not what it's meant for. But it blows the the standard e cig type cigarettes out of the water. And um, this is something nice. I could definitely recommend to someone that is looking for something that is better than their e cigarette type of uh, of device. Um, but doesn't want to go up to something big like an Ego C. Wants something still that's sleek and looks good. This is a, a great option. Um, one of the negatives is uh, you know you can't you can't put like a tank system on it or or anything like that um, without an adapter. I'm sure you could possibly get an adapter and do it that way, but natively you can't do it. So um, you're you're stuck using their their tank system and atomizer um, setup, which isn't bad, um, especially um, if you want to uh, if you want a hotter vape. These are the Ego C type of atomizers, so you could just grab a uh, low res um, atomizer, get it stuck it stick it in there and get a uh, hotter top type vape if you wanted to, but um, yeah. If you're looking for something that's better than an electronic cigarette, don't want to go up to an Ego C type of um, battery and unit, but still looking for a good tank system, this is definitely something I could recommend. So uh, thanks, guys. Uh, OvallyUSA.com. OvallyUSA.com is where you can grab it. Um, if you if you uh, get one, just send them a note. Tell them Vaping Crazy or Shannon sent you. I really appreciate you taking uh, a look at my reviews. If you could, like and subscribe because we have more coming. Um, I know in the near future we're going to be doing uh, three more devices um, and a couple more juices. So they'll be coming. Keep on the lookout. Again, thanks. Have a fantastic day and keep vaping like crazy, baby. Keep vaping like crazy.